Gene Bosler here, Tom Ball, Texas. North of Houston. This 64 inch diameter live oak is, I believe, on the Harris County Registry of Significant Trees. It's beautiful. I mean, it's filming it from this distance does it no justice at all. Uh, the reason I was called out, this is probably going to be part two, so I, I apologize if I repeat myself. But I wanted to show you this tree from a distance. The reason I was called out is because the darn thing is half dead. I mean, this is, this is huge. The HOA waited way too long to call, by the way. Why did they wait so long? So, my first thought is, oh no, this tree must have oak wilt, you know. And sure enough, I find all kinds of symptomatic leaves. But not only was this tree struck by lightning, this pine tree was recently struck by lightning. That's not a very long ago lightning strike. It's probably the same strike, because this one's pretty weak. But this thing sustained a huge lightning strike. With this particular camera, I can't zoom in on the scars. But all of this, see, first of all, it's not characteristic of oak wilt for a tree to hang on to brown leaves. So I found a ton of leaves with venal necrosis, which is the classic uh, symptom of oak wilt on live oak and that's when I started looking around for the scars there's a scar at the base and a huge lightning scar on the other side of the tree <clears throat> lightning scar uh, lightning strikes are known to cause oak wilt like symptoms on the foliage of live oaks and uh, I've seen this before myself on several occasions where a tree struck by lightning or a group of trees struck by lightning put out. See, on this side, the tree looks salvageable. And if this was an oak wilt diagnosis, it would be too late to try to treat. But although virtually half of this tree has browned out or defoliated, I'm not going to give up on this tree just yet. Yes, they could have done a number of things since they developed this site to improve this tree. Yes, they should have put a lightning protection system in it as soon as this tree popped up on their radar. But when is the correct time to put a lightning protection system in a tree? Today. So even though this has already been struck once, this thing needs a lightning protection system in it. It also needs root invigoration. It needs to be fertilized. Um, I wouldn't even recommend a program for this tree, of course, if this were lo if this were oak wilt. When since this is a lightning strike, there are large portions of this crown that actually might have a fighting chance. Thank you for tuning in. Um, feel free to leave a comment if you have any thoughts on this matter.